Seattle may be bigger, but Spokane hosts the state's biggest event, Hoop Fest. A quarter of a million people will flock to downtown this weekend. Spectators, players, and visitors from 42 states. Keeping that many people safe is a monumental task, but one the Spokane Police Department more than happy to take on. KXY Fourth Caroline Rourke working for you tonight with what police want you to know before you join the fun this weekend. Caroline? I mean, Hoop Fest is such a great event for everyone involved, including the Spokane Police Department. They told me today they love being a part of the energy and experience downtown here for Hoop Fest, but with all those people on the way, they need your help to keep it safe. It is a great event for Spokane, and we are really fortunate that it has such a great turnout. We love it. Spokane police will have a larger presence in downtown Spokane this weekend, focusing on public safety so you can focus on the games. Uh, usually it's a pretty low-key event. I mean, some of the things that happen are, are not that elevated. Because they, like you, want to enjoy the Hoop Fest atmosphere. But keeping it safe is their priority. To do that, there are some things they need you to do. For example, did you know Hoop Fest is an animal-free event? Do your dogs, your animals a favor. Leave them at home so that you're not asked to take them out of the park or the entire venue. Plus, if you have to take your pet home, you'll probably have to find a new parking spot when you come back. Those can be few and far between during Hoop Fest weekend while the number of car prowlings sees an increase. Take your valuables out of your car if you can. If not, that get, get them out of sight. Lock your vehicle so you don't present an easy target for a vehicle prowler. Some officers are specifically designated to keep an eye out for prowlers while you play or watch the games. They also have patrols solely focused on DUIs. Let's keep them very bored this weekend, not keep them busy. Don't drink and drive. Use so many of the services that are available out there. A car service, a buddy, sober driver. It's not worth it. SPD and the Spokane Fire Department sent out a list this morning with even more safety tips. If you want to check that out before you head down here this weekend, you can find that on our website. Just search KXOI.com. In downtown Spokane tonight, I'm Caroline Rourke, KXOI 4 News. Thank you, Caroline.